You know, I don't want there to be any hard feelings between us, Harvey. When you and uh, Rachel, Rachel! Rachel were being abducted, I was sitting in Gordon's cage. Now, I, I didn't rig those charges. Your man, your plan. Do I really look like a guy with a plan? You know what I am? I'm a dog chasing cars. I wouldn't know what to do with one if I'd caught it. You know, I just do things. The mob has plans. The cops have plans. Gordon's got plans. You know, they're schemers. Schemers trying to control their little worlds. I'm not a schemer. I try to show the schemers how pathetic their attempts to control things really are. So, when I say, uh, come here, when I say that you and your girlfriend was nothing personal, you'll know that I'm telling the truth. It's the schemers that put you where you are. You were a schemer, you had plans, and uh, look where that got you. I just did what I do best. I took your little plan and I turned it on itself. Look what I did to this city with a few drums of gas and a couple of bullets. Hmm? You, you know what I noticed? Nobody panics when things go according to plan. Even if the plan is horrifying. If tomorrow I tell the press that, like, a gangbanger will get shot, or a truckload of soldiers will be blowing up, nobody panics. Because it's all part of the plan. But when I say that one a little old mare will die. Well, then everyone loses their minds! It's funny how some distance makes everything seem small And the fears that once controlled me can't get to me at all It's time to see what I can do to test the
Hildegard. Sorry to bother you again. Can I come in? Yeah, no, I'm kind of, I'm uh, kind of busy here. I understand. I'll keep it real short then. I'm on my way out of town, but I was wondering, do you mind if I sit down? Carrying a bit of a load here. No. I... Yeah, it's this vehicle I asked you about yesterday. I was just wondering. Yeah, like I told you, we haven't had any vehicles go missing. Okay. Are you sure? Because, I mean, how do you know? Because he, the crime I'm investigating, the perpetrators were driving a car with dealer plates, and they called someone who works here, so it'd be quite a coincidence if they weren't, you know, connected. Yeah, I see. So, how do you... Have you done any kind of inventory recently? The car's not from our lot, ma'am. But how do you know that for sure without doing a... Well, I would know. I'm the executive sales manager. Yeah, but I understand. We run a pretty tight ship here. I know, but, well, how do they establish that, sir? I mean, are the cars counted daily, or what kind of a routine here? Ma'am, I answered your question. I'm sorry, sir? Ma'am, I answered your question. I answered the darn... I'm cooperating here, and there, uh, there's no... Uh... Sir... You have no call to get snippy with me. I'm just doing my job here. I'm... I'm not... Uh, I, I'm not arguing here. I'm cooperating. And there's no... We're doing all we can. Sir, could I talk to Mr. Gustafson? Mr. Lundegaard. Well, heck, if you want to, if you want to play games here, I'm working with you on this thing here, but, okay, I'll do a damn luck count. Sir, right now? Yeah, right now. You're darn tootin'. I could use a vacation. Oh, yes, because you've got such a heavy workload around here. Hmm. How you, uh, how you coming on that novel you're working on? Huh? Got a big, uh, big stack of papers there? Got a, got a, got a nice little... Nice little story you're working on there, a big, big uh, novel you've been working on for three years. Yeah? Got a got a compelling protagonist. Yeah, got a uh, got an obstacle for him to overcome. Yeah? Little story brewing there, working on, working on that for quite some time. Huh? Yeah, talking about that three years ago. Yeah, been working on that the whole time. Nice little uh, narrative, uh, beginning, middle, and end. Some friends become enemies. Some enemies become friends. Yeah. At the end, your uh, main character is uh, richer for the experience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to uh, no, no. You, you deserve.